everyone, Emmy here again, and welcome to another episode of Cobb U. Upgrading our cars can be confusing, especially if you're new to modifying. In the previous video, we discussed what an ECU tune is, what it does, and learned that a tune is the first and simplest modification you can make to your car. So, what's next? There are numerous parts like these, and each will incrementally add power to your car. But looking at all these parts, the question arises, what do I modify first, second, third, and does it really matter in what order I upgrade? Short answer, yes, it does matter, but every vehicle is different. One car may want an intercooler first, while another car may want a downpipe first. Adding the new part, though, is only half the process. Every time you add a new part, the ECU must be reflashed so it can make the necessary adjustments to the engine. This is crucial because upgraded engine parts change how the engine runs. The ECU tune needs to be updated to allow the engine to run safely and to take advantage of the new parts. Confused yet? No worries, because through intense research and development, Cobb has created upgrade paths that maximize power gains each step of the way, with both hard parts and OTS maps that were specifically created for each part or combination of parts. Each vehicle we support is first brought onto our R&D dyno, where Cobb engineers learn the car, its quirks, its strengths, and more importantly, its weaknesses, or things on the car that limit power increases. Once the weaknesses have been identified, the engineers begin rigorous testing where hard parts are created and installed to find the right order and combination for the best incremental power gains. At the same time, maps are created and tested to retune the ECU so that it supports and takes advantage of each part to ensure the engine runs safely. From these results, Cobb is able to create the upgrade path of stage packages that have all the components to either upgrade your car slowly or do it all at once as well as provide the necessary maps. So what exactly is the upgrade path? Take your stock car, get an access port. Flash car, car and driver are happy. Get stage package, install hard parts, and reflash with appropriate OTS map. Car and driver are happier. Get the next stage package, install hard parts, and reflash with appropriate OTS map. Car and driver are even happier and repeat until all packages are complete. Car and driver are insanely happy. So what kind of power gains can you expect for your car? Log on to CobbTuning.com to find your vehicle's stage packages to learn more. And that's it. Can't get any simpler than that. Cobb invests hundreds of man hours to go through each vehicle, design and test parts, as well as create maps to support those parts. All this to make the upgrade process as simple and painless for you as possible while making your car fun as hell to drive on a daily basis. Now that you've had an overview of how your car works, learned the importance of an ECU and tuning, as well as a variety of parts that can be upgraded, we're now going to dive deeper into each of these parts and learn how they affect the engine. We'll begin with the intake and with each episode work our way to the tailpipe. So be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can check out future episodes. That's going to do it for this video. I'm Emmy, your host for Cobb U. Remember to check out CobbTuning.com for all your parts and tuning needs. Do you like the storage solutions featured in our studio? Then visit SonicToolsUSA.com to get more detailed product information.